This video demonstrates how to create a software package based on a batch file, how to deploy this package with IT Client Manager, and how to check the results. Firstly, create the batch file in an empty folder using Notepad. In this example, I'm using the name runbat.bat. It contains the lines echo start run bat date slash t this will just report the current date time slash t for the current time and dir for a directory listing. Save the file and exit. In DSM Explorer, all packages are listed under Software, Software Package Library. To create a new package, right click and select New Software Package. The name I've chosen for the package is RunBat. And the version 1.0. Click OK. The package can now be seen in the Software Package Library. To create the source for the package, drag and drop the runbat.bat file onto the source. The .bat file can be opened and reviewed. To create the procedure for the package, drag and drop runbat.bat from the source onto the procedure section. You can customize the procedure further by right clicking and selecting properties. Here I am adding a parameter to capture the batch output so it can be visible in the DSM Explorer. You need to seal the package to be able to deploy it. Right click and select seal. In the Create New Release window, further details of the package can be entered for Asset Management Recognition. Click Cancel to not create the Asset Management Signature. To deploy the package, drag and drop it into one of the agent machines. Then under Jobs, Software Jobs, you can monitor the progress of the deployment of this package to the agent machine. Once the package has been deployed, it shows up with a green tick. The output of the batch job can be viewed in the Job Output tab. This concludes the demonstration. For more information, contact CA Support. Thank you for watching.